In the labyrinth of human existence lies a fundamental question. Are our choices truly free, or are they predetermined by external forces? The interplay between free will and determinism has sparked centuries of debate among philosophers and thinkers. At the heart of this discourse is the concept of agency, the ability to act independently and make decisions free from coercion. Some argue that every choice we make is influenced by a chain of causes, whether biological, environmental, or societal, leading to the illusion of choice rather than genuine autonomy. Others contend that within the constraints of our circumstances, we possess the power to shape our destinies through conscious decisions. The paradox emerges when we consider the intricate web of factors shaping our choices, our genetics, upbringing, experiences, and even random events. Can we truly claim ownership of our decisions when they are a product of such complex interactions? The exploration of free will extends beyond abstract philosophy into neuroscience, psychology, and ethics. Neuroscientific studies suggest that our brain activity precedes our conscious awareness of making a choice, raising questions about the true origin of our decisions. Does this neurological process undermine the notion of free will, or does it merely unveil the mechanisms through which our choices manifest? Ethical considerations further complicate the matter, as the concept of responsibility becomes entangled with the idea of free will. If our actions are predetermined, how can we hold individuals morally accountable for their deeds? Despite the daunting complexities surrounding free will, the contemplation of our agency remains a deeply personal and existential journey. It forces us to confront the boundaries of our autonomy and grapple with the essence of freedom. Ultimately, whether our choices are predetermined or not, the act of reflection and introspection itself embodies a form of liberation, allowing us to navigate 